Today, we are going to learn about a unique animal called a duck-billed platypus. You can read along with us by downloading the lesson plan from our website, learnbright.org. What is a platypus? What looks like a cross between a beaver and a duck? One of the most unusual looking animals in the world is the duck-billed platypus. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, NOAA, describes the animal as follows. The platypus is a duck-billed, beaver-tailed, otter-footed, egg-laying, aquatic creature native to Australia. That's quite a description. The platypus is semi-aquatic, meaning it lives most of its life between land and water. It has thick fur allowing it to stay in water for hours. The duck-billed platypus is unique, as it is one of the few animals that lay eggs. You heard it right. One trait of mammals is a live birth, but the platypus lays eggs. The female platypus lays eggs in underground burrows near the water's edge. The eggs hatch around two weeks. The baby platypus stays with the mother for about four weeks. Then the young platypus swims off to forage or find food on its own. What do they eat? You may think their bill, beaver tail, and webbed feet look strange. They are useful tools to help the platypus survive. The duck's bill may look very stiff and hard, but it's not. The bill is flexible, soft, and has thousands of receptors or supersensory organs. Because they are bottom feeders, the platypus needs these receptors to find food in the dark, muddy, and murky waters. Like sharks, these receptors send out signals that locate prey. The platypus uses its webbed feet to push through the water quickly. Its tail is like a rudder on a ship steering the animal to where it wants to go. Once the platypus has reached the bottom, it pushes the bill into the sand scooping out small shellfish or insects. The platypus can stay underwater for nearly two minutes before it surfaces to breathe air. Other interesting facts. Here's an interesting fact. The platypus doesn't have teeth. So as it shovels mud and silt into its bill, it also captures gravel and small rocks. These are used to chew and grind food. The platypus is a small animal that grows to about 15 inches in length. Adults weigh about three pounds. The enemies of the platypus are snakes, birds, and wild dogs if they wander onto land. The platypus is a shy creature and seems defenseless from predators or animals that attack other animals for food. But don't let their looks fool you. The males have sharp stingers on their rear feet. The stingers are venomous or capable of delivering a poisonous sting to attackers. Scientists believe the platypus may be one of the earliest mammals to inhabit the earth. The platypus may have been around before dinosaurs became extinct more than 112 million years ago. Why are they important to the environment? Unfortunately, the platypus is endangered and may become extinct if more protection is not given to these remarkable creatures. In the early 1900s, the platypus was hunted for its fur. Until the 1950s, a large number of the animal got tangled in fishermen's nets and drowned. Since then, fishermen's nets have ways for the platypus to escape if they accidentally get caught. However, the greatest threat to the platypus is the destruction of their natural habitat along the Australian coast. Bushfires, pollution, dams for irrigation, and increased human activity on the coast have created cause for concern. The platypus is important to the environment in several ways. First, it is a carnivore and helps keep the population of the insects and shellfish it dines on in check. Second, 
It is one of the last remaining egg-laying mammals left on the planet. Finally, scientists believe the venom in the ankles of the male platypus may contain potential antibiotics or medicines that fight disease. Wow, we have learned a lot about the duck-billed platypus. Let's review what you have learned. Why is the platypus endangered? Where did you find the information? True or false? The duck-billed platypus does not have teeth. True. Choose the word the author would say best describes the platypus. A. Defenseless. B. Venomous. C. Unique. D. Endangered. E. Predator. C. Unique. Great job, friends! Remember, you can find this lesson and other great lesson plans on our website, learnbright.org. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.